So what is up guys, my name is Moonog and welcome to the Collector's Edition unboxing. Literally just woke up, saw that it was delivered, and I already took it out of its original box. I, um, I don't reveal my address, but we're gonna unbox this thing. Now I originally was gonna get the Ellie Edition, but the Ellie Edition sold out quickly and I never really got a chance to uh, uh, get my hands on one because every time they were back in stock people would uh, Immediately buy them <laughs> So Yeah, I have no idea. I've never done an unboxing video. This isn't gonna be the greatest quality But it is gonna be Fun <laughs> Yeah, slide out too. It's pretty fucking sweet. I like that. Okay, smells fucking weird. <laughs> Alright, so I think the first thing I'm going to pull out here is, what is this? The art. It's out of The Last of Us Part 2. It's pretty cool. Nice little thing that can just sit up on my shelves that I don't have. <laughs> so that's pretty sweet. This might be. What is this? Doesn't want to come out. Oh, there we go. Last of Us Part Two. Oh, whoa! It's like a weird thank you letter or something. What would you do if someone you love was a was a victim of a cruel, violent act? Oh, you mean, you mean my boy? <laughs> Still not over that. <laughs> Um, how does could one's mind tip towards violent retribution? How far would you go to bring the people responsible to justice? If you were successful, how would you, how would it change you? Would you ever be the same? With Last of Us Part 2, we set to create an experience that explores these difficult questions. It's basically Naughty Dog and Neil Druckmann saying thank you for, uh, embarking on the journey with us. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna keep that. Um, do I put it back in here? We'll just put it back in there for now, because <laughs> I have no idea. And then, this box is huge, by the way. Is this a steelbook? Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? This bitch is on it? Why, Naughty Dog? Naughty Dog? Why is this bitch on the case? You know who that should be? That should be my boy Joel, not my boy... Not my... Say my boy. <laughs> not my fucking stupid... Uh, really not at all. Come on. Okay, if she's on the back of the case, that definitely means she's a very important character, so I guess that's fine. I don't know. Ooh. Claim my content. Okay. It's a steelbook case. Like I said, it's a two disc game install, but I already have the game installed. It's up on my screen. I'm about to record part three after this. This is pretty sweet. I like it. I like it. Not bad. Nice little... I mean, I wish it was Joel in the background, but that's fine. This one still feels heavy as she's book. I'll put that there. Now we're getting into the real goodies. Got some logo sticker thingies. I think there's stickers. Yeah, there's stickers. Cool. Something to put on my computer. Um, it's a bracelet. I remember seeing this thing in the trailers. I think it's like a, I think it's Dina's bracelet that Dina gives to Ellie or something. I'm pretty sure. And then, oh, some sweet ass pins. I like that. I like that a lot. It's pretty sweet. And there's all this stuff in it. Not bad. I think we're now at the goody goody part. We're at the goody goody part now. Ooh, scary. Oh yeah, we're at the statue. This is the part I'm excited for. 
Really wish I got the LZ edition. Would have came with an exact replica of her backpack, which would have been sweet to have and put in the background, but that's okay. You know, the assholes that just spam bought it just to sell it on eBay to make a buck. You know, compared to me, who would, who are a huge fan, who would really use it for a good reason. Holy shit, this statue is huge. <laughs> oh my god. I thought it was smaller. Ah, smells weird. <laughs> oh, that's a very sensitive part. I've never owned like a part. I never owned a. This thing's fucking huge. This thing's fucking huge. I thought I was gonna be able to fit this on my desk. Okay, let's be careful. Dude. This thing is fucking huge. <gasps> I like the detail though. I like the shoes. It's a lot of detail in the shoes. Face looks good. Not the greatest, to be honest. There you go. Detail on the face could have been a little better, but I guess like doing stuff like that isn't exactly easy. It still looks good though. It's not like how s some statues look. Backpack has a lot of fucking detail. I love it. Gotta take this little plastic thing off the bone arrows though. That's scary. I have to use like both hands to do that. <laughs> Arrows are really fragile. Why? Ooh, that's scary. That would have sucked if it would have broke. Wow. Got the tattoo. I'm loving it. I am absolutely in love with this statue. <laughs> I just don't have anywhere to put it. I thought it was going to be a smaller so I could put it on my desk. Fuck me. Okay, well, that's fine. I'll just place you there, at least. Alright, well, that was the unboxing. Sorry it wasn't the greatest quality. I was originally going to do it with my phone, but I tested out that footage. Um, as I did, like, a practice footage, and the quality was even way worse. So I thought, no, and I'll just do it with this camera. Do it right on my desk, or my gaming chair. So, yeah, I'm going to play more of the last of us part two for you guys as a video because that's how the rest of the playthrough is going to go on hopefully you enjoyed the unboxing i wish this was the ellie edition but you know what that's okay to the assholes that just spam bought it just to sell it on ebay for a way higher price fuck you that's a horrible thing to do <laughs> um but yeah see you guys in the next episode of last of us part two goodbye everybody